All right, let's do this. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lower the bed, obviously, pull the winch out, but I'm gonna lower the wheel lift onto the ground and use that as my foot so I don't slide back. All right, I've dug myself in. I'm gonna lower the foot, make sure that's planted. And now we'll uh, throw some chains and a snatch block on this. I don't have enough traction to pull the winch out. The new guys never wrap up the winch cable nicely, so it's always hard to pull back out. See if it starts. Smells like weed in here. It doesn't appear this car has a neutral. So, uh, just start pulling and see what happens. We can turn the front wheel to the left a little bit. Uh, we can just angle the thing straight up and it'll roll up and I can be out of here. enough. Alright. They've straightened out a little bit, so uh, let's turn them back to the right, or to the left again. stuck. Right. So we're going 
going to just hook a line here. So I can let this down. shorten these chains, put them up there farther, so I have more winch line, because the, uh, the, the wheels over there are still off the edge. So, same deal, we'll just move this chain over here to lower it. So we see, uh, we're gonna have to do it the other way. that right there for now just to hold this so I can uh, extend that winch line out farther it can be real tight This is uh, for a backup camera at one time. this truck has a park so Safety straps. We need safety.
if you're new to towing, this is not what you want to do in an ideal situation. All of the weight right now is behind these rear axles. So my front end is gonna bounce up a little bit and it's gonna be harder for me to stop and steer. So if you can, always put the, the motor of the vehicle towards the middle of the truck. But clearly, we're on the highway at the tail end of a blizzard and it's backwards, so it's not like I have a whole lot of room to make U-turns and stuff. So, you just gotta do what you gotta do for the most part, but do it safely. And then by crossing the chains like this, I now have side to side stability instead of just front and back. And then they also tighten against each other. So one's not a little bit loose or anything like that. So we're all good, time to go.